Hi, I'd like to introduce you to the connection lines on Novamind. Connection lines are what join the branches with their children branches. There are two settings that you can change for your connection lines. You can change the line style for the connection back to the parent, or you can change the connection style for the connections from the selected branch to its children. By default, all the connection lines are solid lines, and all the children connections are set to inherit their settings from their parent. And that means that eventually it will go back to the mind map title, and if the title doesn't have any style set, then it uses the curved style. You can see that the settings are inherited, and it's drawn with the default line styles. Now I'll show you this on both Mac and Windows. So first on the Mac version, let's select the mind map title and change the connection style to straight lines. And you can see that the lines go straight to the children branches. And you can see that the children branches all the way down automatically inherit that setting. So let's try out the curve setting, which is the default. Then the elbow. Then the rounded elbow. And finally, sheared or chamfered elbow. On Windows, the settings are found here under the Format tab. And the settings are all the same, just like this. Now let's explore the shapes that you get with the positioning of branches in different places. To show you this, we'll switch to Free Layout mode and start moving the branches around. First, let's move the first level branch around. You'll see that when using the straight line style, it draws directly to the branch wherever you put it. But with any of the three elbow styles, it will draw out of the nearest side of the mind map title, and if you're above or below the title, then it will draw the line with bends in it to be able to get to the end of the branch. When we start moving the child branches around, we'll find that the behavior is much the same, with the lines being drawn so that they connect with the end of the branches. Now, so far, all we've looked at is setting the mind map title connection style but we can also change it at each level. So let's change it here to straight, and here to curved, and here to elbow. So now you're beginning to see the flexibility of the connection styles. Now if we add sub-branches to one of these branches, you can see that the default is to inherit the settings unless you explicitly override them. The other setting you have is the connection line style. Remember that the connection styles need to apply to the children, or you would end up with some really ugly looking combinations. Well, with the connection line styles, it's quite likely that you do want to have some branches with dotted lines, and some with solid lines, and so on. So the line style applies to the connection from the selected branch to its parent. So let's select this branch, and change the line style for the connection line to a dashed line and you can see the way that that's drawn. So now you have a good idea of what you can do with the connection lines, and I suggest that you have some fun and try them out for yourself.